Wednesday. Back to uh, Tuesday's weather front, though, because it will provide cloud and outbreaks of rain across these more central parts, sinking south into the Midlands, parts of Wales. Far south may stay generally dry, brightening up further north. And then that weather front continues to work its way southwards. It will bring some rain to East Anglia in the southeast, although I fancy not enough for the uh, farmers and the gardeners. And it's gone pretty much by Wednesday. And behind it, by Wednesday, all of us in that fresher air, so it won't feel quite as uh, humid. Still pleasant enough when the sun comes out, 23 degrees Celsius. There will be a few showers into the northwest. Now, for uh, Thursday, we've still got that uh, situation with high pressure down to the southwest. Another little tangle of weather fronts trying to approach. May bring a bit of cloud and some rain into Northern Ireland later on. But for many on Thursday, again, by the odd shower, it's looking dry and fine. And again, in some sunshine, temperatures reaching the uh, low 20s. Now, by the time we get to the end of the working week, these weather fronts start to get more organised, uh, a more meaningful area of low pressure. So we could see things turning uh, distinctly wetter across more northern parts during Friday. Again, in the south, it may stay generally dry with some sunshine temperatures in the low 20s. As always, some uncertainty about the end of the week. You can always keep up to date with the weather forecast online. That's all from me. It's back to Adam and to Ellie. Goodbye.